The 2025 Toyota Land Hopper is the company's first effort into the subcompact off-road SUV market, and everyone is quite thrilled. The Land Hopper is advertised as a more small and fairly priced alternative to the traditional Land Cruiser, with the goal of appealing to a diverse range of consumers looking for robust off-road capability in a more affordable and controllable vehicle. Because of its tiny size and construction, the Land Hopper is a smaller and more agile variant of the Land Cruiser, making it ideal for both urban settings and off-road adventures. It is likely to measure roughly 4,460 mm long and 1825 mm wide, giving it a similar appearance to the Toyota Corolla Cross. Reasonable Cost One of the Land Hopper's most notable features is its low cost. The base price is expected to be around 3 million yen, which is approximately 31,000 US dollars or 40,000 Australian dollars, making it the least costly vehicle in the Land Cruiser family. This offers it an advantage over competitors like the Suzuki Jimny and the Jeep Wrangler. Land Hopper Off-Road Capability The Land Hopper will stick to its Land Cruiser heritage by adopting a ladder frame chassis, which ensures exceptional off-road performance. It will be an excellent pick for adventurers because to its predicted tough terrain capabilities. Toyota could launch the Land Hopper at the Tokyo Auto Show in 2024 or early 2025, with a commercial debut in the second part of that year. Toyota expects that by releasing this car, it would have a stronger presence in the small SUV category, where it can answer the needs of people wanting for a capable off-road vehicle but unable to justify the high prices of more spacious vehicles. The Land Hopper has the potential to disrupt the compact SUV market by combining Toyota's famed toughness and off-road capability in a new, smaller form factor.